welcome to NYFA News. I am Urvashi Barwa. We will have all the stories and more. But first, let's take a look at the headlines. Warsaw is holding one of the most important international conference, NATO Heads of the State Summit. This is the first time Poland has hosted a top-level military meeting with the Western alliances since it joined NATO in the year 1999. The President had a bilateral meeting with the Prime Minister of India, Narendra Modi, discussing a number of topics like economic cooperation, climate change and cybersecurity. Two devout spiritual leaders of the Bangladeshi Muslim community were killed on August 15th in Queens. An arrest has been made, but police did not initially label it a hate crime, which upset many in the community, including the victims' families. Surveillance video shows the moment of the attack. A popular Imam Molama Akonzi and his assistant Tara Udin were gunned down at point-blank range in broad daylight. Witness Nurul Haq describes what he says happened to the victims that afternoon. It just uh, after the noon prayers, he was going home and he tore to the Glenmore and 79th Street when he make a left. And then when he turned to see he hit the Liberty Avenue on the right side, the man come the behind and blind side and stay short. Suspect Oscar Morel is pleading not guilty. Investigators say they have recovered the handgun used in the murder from Morel's apartment in Brooklyn. Hi guys, I'm here in Madrid today. Let's go check out Madrid through my eyes. New Yorkers strolling in Midtown Manhattan on Sunday probably felt like they were in India. Thousands of Indians were here to celebrate a major national holiday. India won its independence after 150 years of British rule in August 1947. To observe the anniversary, the Federation of Indian Association sponsors the world's largest India Day parade. Today at Madison Avenue, Indians from New York have gathered together to celebrate India's Independence Day, which was on 15 August. I'm standing here today in front of the Flatiron Building, where Cheddar, a new news company, has just done their launch party with a huge mass gathering. Today I came all the way down from Manhattan to Flushing and Queens to have some authentic Chinese food in one of my favorite places, Tofu Chow. We have out here shrimp dumplings. You can see these dumplings. Like This is so good. This is like, wow, my favorite dumpling. So how do you eat them? You have to dip it a little bit on the soy sauce and the sauce which they give you out here, the red sauce and it's too big, it's too big. The Fair NATO is happening for the first time in New York City. Their aim is to motivate global process through science and technology, art and culture and food. Reporting from Poland, from White House, I'm Urvashi Barwa. Thank you for watching us. We will see you next time.